Yo, 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 what up world and welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be playing some old school RuneScape. However, this isn't your typical RuneScape account. As we are playing as a hardcore Iron Man, but not only are we playing as a hardcore Iron Man, we're also going to be trying our hand at being a one chunk account. Hopefully we don't die and lose our hardcore status, but let's be real here. I'm probably going to be uh, dying quite a bit at the lower levels here, depending on the chunk we roll. Uh, with that being said, this account will be a free to play style account as I don't really have much time to play and I don't want to be stuck in any of these meme grimes for like 20 years or so. That would just not be fun. Uh, this may change in the future, depending on the popularity of the account and how everything goes, and also depending on work and if my playtime is able to change. For anyone that doesn't know what a one chunk account is, uh, it is where I am pretty much locked into a square or a chunk on the map, and I must complete a set list of tasks before I can do um, anything else, really. I got to finish everything in that little chunk that I have before I can proceed to a new chunk. So actually, I should probably put on the, um, uh, let's go chunk, uh, the region locker, I think it is. Is that right? Yeah, that's that. And then I think I have to put the chunk GPU on actually. Yeah, there it is. Okay. So as you can see, everything is all kind of grayed out now. And I think I have to hit shift or something here. Yeah, see, there you go. When you unlock it, it turns hey normal. When you lock it, it turns uh, back to gray saying, hey, don't walk here. So that is exactly what I will be doing with that. Um, and then we're going to hop over to... I believe it's uh, source chunk. Yes, it's source chunk. It's a chunk picker where we're going to be able to see where we start as I want to um, start this off with a uh, randomly rolled chunk. So hopefully I can set up the uh, chunk picker correctly. Let's just uh, figure out how the heck to get over there. Uh, it should be this one, right? Wait, whoops. How come it's not showing? properties ah, okay there it is right here so as you can see uh this is what the trunk picker looks like you'll be able to click on something um and see all the tasks that you need to do like there's guards in there there's amps there's item spawns everything that you need to do for the information um if we do pick a chunk it'll just come up here telling us what we have to do in that chunk. Now, I did set it up for, uh, where is this? Miscellaneous down here. Free to play, restricted to free to play only. As I said, I'm going to be free to play only. And the main goal of this account before I can unlock pay to play or members is uh, I want to complete Dragon Slayer. Yes, I want to be able to defeat the dragon. And I think that will be a well off. Uh, we're well versed in the game to then expand out into the rest of the map. If we zoom out, like we have all of this map to explore, not just this little tiny area right here. So with that being said, I'm uh, going to roll a trunk trunk. I'm going to roll a chunk and then we will uh, go on a bit about the rules. So drum roll, please. And we will roll the chunk and hopefully land in a free-to-play area please i'm pretty sure that's a free-to-play area right is it i don't think it actually is it might be um okay let's uh head on over there and if it isn't then i'm gonna come back to the chunk and figure out where uh, I went wrong because I'm pretty sure I clicked free to play area only. Um, and there is a fence there. I don't think I can get past that fence truly, but uh, we'll see. I will be right back. All right, back into RuneScape we go. Um, I guess I'll just walk over in there and see if it's uh, free to play. We can unlock that region just like that. And I'm going to have to walk all the way around like that. Or I can just get there with that 10 coins in my bank. Maybe I'll do that really quickly. Uh, I am going to drop all of these items because, of course, uh, we're not allowed to start with those. 
spot. So let's quickly run up to the bank here and grab out that money just so I can get over there a little bit quicker and unlock the least amount of music tracks possible. So we come up here all the way up to the top. Go into the bank. And we got ourselves a 25 coins. We're going to get rid of this net as well. And we can hide that like that. Okay. Now let's see if we can get over there and actually see uh, if it's a free to play area. I think it might be. Um, but I think it's actually a really good way to try and get the uh, imbues. I mean, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we're going to pay the toll. We're going to unlock a boatload of music tracks, unfortunately. It's just the way it is at that point. Um, it's not even saying that I'm unlocking music tracks, though, when I'm coming through here. I mean, the gate's open, so it must be. We should do like... Uh... What? Wait, what? No, I want that unfiltered. There we go. Uh, okay, yeah, so we do have access to this area. All right, this is our starting point. Um, hold on, I have to drop this gold. We'll drop it right there. There we go. Let's come into the center here and uh, actually the very top and um, go over our, our rule set here. All right, as you can tell, uh, I am in the arena now and the type of rules that we're going to be doing on this because I don't, like I said, want to have any of those crazy, crazy meme grinds and stuff like that. Um, all of it will be in the um, rules that I went in in the uh, pick trunker, but just kind of an overview where um, processing skills, smithing, stuff like that. I just have to get to the level that I can smith it. So. Uh, the hardest skill here, I believe, would be uh, smithing if I go into the wilderness and unlock those rune rocks because that would be my primary source of uh, rune ore. Um, I'm not going to go off of uh, drops and stuff like that where if I get a drop of rune ore, I don't have to then go get 85 smithing to smelt it. I, I need a uh, primary source in order to get that level. Um, stars will not be a part of uh, primary training. Uh, I'm not going to be world hopping, looking for stars all the time. Uh, I use them to train, but I will not be uh, getting to level 90 mining with a bronze pickaxe on stars. There's just no way I'm doing that. Um, it'll probably take me about 30 years uh, in game time. So. <laughs> um, so the basics of that is if I do unlock those rune rocks, I need to get 85 smithing to smith a rune or and to then process it into a rune dagger. I don't have to go all the way up to 99 or 98 with a boost in to get the uh, rune plate body. And that's mostly just because of my time constraint. I can always change these rules the further we get in if I do have more time, uh, depending on the uh, popularity of the account and everything. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's jump right into this. Uh, if we scroll back over to the uh, chunk picker here, I need to get a best, obtain a uh, best melee weapon, unarmed. I already have that. I am unarmed. Okay, and then the next thing that we have to get is this bronze axe. So somewhere right there. Perfect. Best skilling bronze axe. And you might be thinking to yourself, but you can wield that bronze axe. Yes, I can. Oh my God, my mouse. Yes, I can wield it. But because it is um, slower speed than the fists, um, your fists are usually better. Um, so now we can hit obtain that. So that should be everything now obtained as far as I know. Uh, and now I can be able to roll another chunk. Right. So if I do that, 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 I think. No, wait, I can't do that. Or can I get to uh, Giant's Plateau from down here? I don't think I can get through this gate. Let's go double check here really quickly. Uh, flip it back over to here. 
Um, oh, <clears throat> it looks like I can get up over into here. Uh, that's not going to be fun. <laughs> if I get into that chunk, oh my gosh, that is not going to be fun at all. I can get to the back here. So technically it is a rollable chunk, even though it will be a dead one. Uh, let's run up to the top here because I think I can get into the top as well. Um, into the uh, magic training area. Yeah, because there, there's a bank and stuff like that. So I can go that way. And then I can also get into um, Northern Al Karid. So Giant's Plateau is going to be uh, really bad if I unlock that one. Because I would have to uh, kill some hill giants. And I do not have the stats to kill hill giants. I will tell you that right now. I don't even think I'd be able to damage them. So this is going to be a uh, a fun one if I roll it. Um, hopefully I don't roll it. Um, but that should be all of my chunks done there. Uh, calculate tasks. Best in slots all done. I am now able to roll and I'm on the wrong screen yet again. I will get used to it. So the best in tasks, as you can see right up here, are all done. And then uh, one, two, three, four. We definitely do not want to go four. Me personally, I would love to move over to uh, three or one. Um, I don't think I can. Yes, I can get through that way, I believe. It looks like there's an opening there, so that would be pretty cool. Uh, there is Addy Ore here, which is not very cool because then I'll that's a massive grind right off the bat. Uh, let's check out our chunk. And rolling, 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 rolling. What do we get? What do we get? Ooh, okay. We got the Mage Training Arena. That is now... Uh, unlocked and there's no tasks there there are no tasks there let's head on over and just double check it to make sure um, but there are none so we come over to here and then I have to unlock uh, sorry I have to go into my map and then I can unlock this guy and then this 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 are now open uh, so here's our new chunk do I have access to this bank, though? That would be very nice if I have access to the bank. Or is this a members-only bank? No, I would have run energy. Hey, all right, we got access to a bank. Yay! <laughs> I don't need to be an iron, or I don't need to be an ultimate Iron Man at the very beginning. That is something I was not expecting. Okay, item spawns. So if I ever get a pickaxe. Oh god, I really hope I don't get a pickaxe if I roll this chunk over here. I do have access to this chunk via this little hole right here. Um, That's about it. If I do end up getting members, though, we got to unlock all of Affinity and everything. That is going to be uh, absolutely great and fun. Um, All right. On to the uh, pick chunk picker again. And time to roll another chunk. Uh... Activity, chunk tasks. I can't calculate anything because there's no tasks available. Right? Calculate tasks. Hey, we're done. All right. So next one. Um, can I actually get through the top of this one? I'm just going to have to walk up there off screen. Because, oops. There. there. Yeah, those two are supposed to be open. Because I don't know if I can get up through here. I think I can get access up there. Uh, it doesn't actually look like I can. I'm trying to walk up there. Nope. It's, uh, not allowing my character to walk up there. So I don't think I have access up there. Definitely don't. Maybe if I run across to the other side here, one second. You guys can't see this, but. Now you can. I <laughs> uh, definitely can't run up that way either. Okay. So that one is not unlockable up there. Um, 
this guy right up here by the exam center is not unlockable so we have ourselves another whopping i guess i could technically go right there that's why that five is on there uh we're gonna go again let's roll the chunk please no uh okay take me there <laughs> um that's a useless one again oops i keep hitting the wrong buttons uh there's nothing there it's just literally bare desert i guess we're rolling again oh my gosh i'm just i'm rolling all of these other ones okay that is another dead chunk i'm fully oh the arena is fully unlocked now i can go everywhere in this arena uh i got one two what's this guy down here oh i guess because i can go in right there wait what's over here is there mining over there i'm gonna have to run over there and have a look and have a quick little look see look -sees. It looks like there is iron and coal over there. Um, oh, wait, I can just do this. I can hit this. Uh, item spawns, beer glass bucket, logs. Okay. Monsters, a billy goat and four goats. I mean, I could start training on that stuff, but I technically don't have access to it because it's right there. Um, no. God. Right there is where I'm going, I'm, I'm assuming, is where I'm going. Uh, I'm trying to run over there on the other account right now. Let's see if we can get that up here. Just to check it out. Uh, I think it's a... Dead chunk. How do I get up there? Why is that available for me to go to? It shouldn't be available for me to go to. There's no way I have access to anything in there. It's all fenced off. See? You can see the green line right across here, right? Can I get up there? Nope. Huh. That's weird why that is appearing like that. I don't have access to it. Right? Nope. No access to it. Okay. So I will take that off of the uh, chunk picker. So this guy comes off like that. Okay, so now, oh my gosh, this whole thing is just nothing but rolls. <laughs> okay, okay, so now we can roll another chunk. Let's see where we get. That's like a 33% chance I'm going to get screwed here. Giant's Plateau, okay, take me there. Oh my gosh. Gosh, I don't know how the heck I'm going to do this. Um, well, we'll have to figure it out. Flinching, I'm assuming. What do I need? I need to get a uh, steel weapon, okay, which will be a steel scimitar. I need to get my best in slot range of melee helmet, which is an iron medium helmet, a iron kite shield, and a staff. I will also need to get a bronze pickaxe well that's not fun at all uh and then i need to get a giant's key if i need to kill a boatload of giants i need well i'm gonna have to do that anyways um the bronze pickaxe is making me very very close towards uh number two up here which is that addy or which oh gosh that's gonna be uh a very that's gonna be like 200 hour grind probably <laughs> into this bank and then back and bank and back and bank and back uh well we'll see what happens let's uh unlock this over on the other account here and let's go on in to the giants plat oh giants foundry uh members only quest there is an anvil here too so that would unlock um smithing kind of i have bars right Okay, let's run up here and see what level these hill giants are. Like 
like in the 20s, I think, maybe. Um, there's that guy. There's my bronze pickaxe right there. Oh, gosh. I really hope there's something else in this chunk or something that I can lure into the chunk and kill. There's no men. There's nothing. Level 28. Oh, there's a bronze scimitar and a wooden shield, though. Yes. Okay, perfect. Um, oh, there's the staff as well. Um, so I might be able to make this work. I might be able to make this work. Let's grab this and this. I can wield those. Well, the best thing too here is, um, I'm going to get lots of, uh, big bones, right? But I'm probably going to die an absolute boatload of time. Um, do these guys have aggression towards me? That is the question I have. Maybe. Yes, they do. Okay. No, run. Run away. You can kill me. Okay, so he stops right there. So the question I have is... He can one-hit me. Um, I should have wiki... Wiki these guys up here really quickly. Uh, hill Giants. Desert Plateau Hill Giants. Recommended stats to kill these guys. Full rune. <laughs> a full full rune, and I'm uh I got myself a bronze scimitar. I think we're good. I think we're good. How much health do they have? How much defense do they have? Uh they don't have anything for melee defenses, which is good. They have a max hit of four. So if I run forward. Why is this guy? Oh. What the heck is going on there? What's settings? Oh, man. Uh, left click where avail available and NPC. Yeah. No. Yeah, that's what I want. Player attack. I want hit. There we go. Okay, well, now I got to wait up a little couple seconds here to uh, get my health back and uh, we'll see if I can get <clears throat> in there let's go like this and peg all okay so there should be a way that I can trap these guys behind here is this something I can step on yes okay so this whole area here I can step on can I step here yes I can okay uh, let's bury that that's gonna be some prayer experience I might try to lure them over this way. I gotta see how I can get one over here. Okay, so right there. Then he goes away right away. So I have to get him lured like that. It's gonna take some time to get these guys lured in. Uh, there's no other way that I can gain experience uh, in these chunks. I'll fit around, I'll round with this for a little bit and try and figure it out. If I can, can't figure anything out, then um, I don't know. I might have to backlog one at this guy until I get like a better um, training method or something. Because I don't think I can actually damage these guys at all. So I'll be right back. Okay, I think I might have figured it out. Um, I need to be marked tile right there. So, I have to lure one in now. I managed to get one hit on it. So, <laughs> one hit out of uh, how many hit points do they have? Uh, 35. Okay, cool. So, it's only going to take me about 16 years to kill one. <laughs> well, better than mining adamant, I guess. Um, let's see if I can get you. If I run over here. This is kind of how I have to damage them. Just like that. Um, unfortunately, I'm now limited to my run energy. So this is going to be absolutely great. Until I get some levels. Like, there's no even, like, no rats or anything, man. There's nothing. Who's this guy? Do you do anything for me? Dr. Ford? Talk? You can't even... Oh, what do you want? 
Uh, why are you out here on your own? I was drawn here for a doctor until I arrived at Algrid. Uh, then I heard it called to me. I immediately gave up depression to set up here. What is he on about? What voices? What? If I listen, I think this dude's on crack. Ooh, we have a tinderbox. Okay, so we have a tinderbox, a bronze pickaxe, a hammer is over there. In that crate. Um, there's got to be something else around here somewhere. Nothing, not even like a rat. I might have to go through all of my chunks to try and find a rat or something like that. Um, let's see now. There's a way I can get these guys stuck. Um, they always want to be the south tiles. So I have to like be over here somewhere. Might have to like hop on my main and see if there's any areas that uh they can get stuck at. So like if I hit you and then run back up here. So this is kind of how you have to do it. Just like this. See, look, I got a one. But training like this is going to be a very long process. Um, and then they run away like that. So 13, 12. So it's pretty much an energy every time I hit him. Uh, if he stays in that one spot, right? And now he's gone. But what if I try this guy? And here's the thing is I might not even get a kill because that... Like, this guy's going around smacking stuff, too. So, hmm, let me think about this. I might have to, like, backlog it in order just to keep the progression going. Because that's going to take me, like, 40 hours just to kill one of these guys. Because I'm going to have to level up so high. Um, Yeah, I'm going to be right back and let me think about it. All right, so I finally got over to here for the flinching. Because I'm going to be flinching them right around this uh, corner area here. Um, and I finally found a world that doesn't have freaking 17 people in it trying to kill hill giants here. Um, so all I have to do now is just lure one over here without dying, please. Uh, and then I'll be able to flinch it. Okay. Boom. Just like that. So then I can unmark this tile and mark this tile. This is where I stand. And this guy is just going to sit here on top of me. So that is beautiful. All I have to do is click and go back and hopefully not leg out and die. They can max hit at a four. There's a staff there. I wonder if I should be able to take that one of these times. But this is pretty much what I'm going to be doing um, for the next foreseeable future. I don't know what my experience in hour is going to be. Probably like 120 or so. Um, but yeah, this is pretty much going to be it for this episode. Just the beginning ones. My little pilot. And uh, episode two, hopefully, I will have uh, killed at least one hill giant in episode two. Um, until then, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you all for joining me. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, give it a big old thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are on my starting location and how screwed I got. Hey, at least I'm not mining uh, 70. At least I'm not getting 70 mining right now. Watching me fulfill this chunk and then unlock that chunk and do another grind. Oh, my God god that would be absolutely atrocious but you know what sometimes that is what it is but i'll see you in the next one peace